and we are all set for the Stadion Hotel. Iced waterfall, a good break there. Left behind was Marshall Murphy, but not by too much. It is Iced Waterfall who leads, followed by April Song. Then comes Memphis Bell, Field Cut, and Marshall Murphy still trails. About seven lengths separate this field as they head towards the cemetery bend. Iced Waterfall, April Song on his shoulders, Field Cut, and Memphis Bell behind that. Marshall Murphy is still the back marker. Iced Waterfall is still the leader. April Song challenging on the outside. About a length or two behind comes Field Cut. Two lengths behind Field Cut is Memphis Bell. One length behind that is Marshall Murphy. And as they hit the home straight, it looks to be between April Song and Iced Waterfall. Hanny Grayling sitting comfortably on Iced Waterfall. He had to pop the question. Gl April Song looks to be under pressure. Marshall Murphy is looming on the inside. But Iced Waterfall is holding strong. But look, April Song is coming. Marshall Murphy being asked there to go. April and going strongly, Marshall Murphy by Mohendi. Ice Waterfall is beaten. Marshall Murphy wins. Marshall Murphy wins. Ice Waterfall, then April Song, Field Cut, and Memphis Belly Trails. Marshall Murphy wins. And I have here the winning connections of the winner of our fourth race, the Stadion Hotel Handicap, won by that brilliant ride by Mohende on Marshall Murphy. Um, Joki Mohende, you sat at the back all through until the home straight, and it looked like at one point Iced Waterfall had disappeared from the radar, but then you were able to catch up and go home and cruise easily. How was the race, how did it unpan for you? Yeah, the horse has been difficult to get out of the soft, but lucky today he gets out on the t on time. And I had to settle behind the other horses until the last 400 meters. I asked the horse to quicken. Although they were the first race, uh, the pacemaker was almost to get the wind, and I kept pace and until the last two turns. Well, congratulations on a very good win. I have a jubilant owner of Marshall Murphy, Niresh Patel. And just talk us through, it was nail biting, wasn't it? Oh, yes. And uh, as I said, you know, horse racing is uh, moments of uh, huge disappointment and few minutes of great thrill. And I thought at the turn, he was left behind. He came through. Brilliant horse. So relieved. So happy. <laughs> well. That is all the uh, thrill shared by the, the trainer, Oli Gray. Oli, all through your many years riding here, I mean, it's such moments that make people come racing. Just talk us through. Well, I'm just so pleased for the owner. He, he's been so patient. This horse has had so much trouble. I mean, he's anything that could happen to him happened to him. He's been a nightmare to train. But he's been so patient, the owner. And I kept saying, you know, if we get him right, he, he's a decent horse. He gets left a bit at the start. He came through nicely today. I mean, I'm just so pleased for the owner. He deserves it. Well, very many congratulations. And don't go too far. There will be a presentation from Sports Kenya. The full results of our fourth race, the Stadion Hotel Handicap. The winner, horse number three, Marshall Murphy. Second, horse number one, Iced Waterfall. Third, horse number five, April Song. Fourth, horse number two, Phil Cut. And fifth, was number four, Memphis Bell. And indeed, the race was the Stadion Hotel Handicap. So we'll ask Lillian to present the first goodie bag to the owner of Marshall Murphy, the delightful and elated Niresh Patel. Makofi Tafadali. 
And next in line is the jockey of Marshall Murphy, James Mohende. Makofi. And finally, the trainer, Oliver Gray. A big hand of applause to Fazali.